Hi guys and welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, I'm bringing you to what I believe that could be the next new biggest deck in the standard format for 2018 to 2019, and that is Glaceon Zorwark. Now this isn't a deck that I created myself. I was out with a couple of my mates today and um, we were just testing some new decks for post rotation and my mate Martin has built this Glacier and Zorak deck and my god was it an amazing deck. It has took down like Ray Crazer, it's took down like Metagross because Metagross is starting to get back into things. It has taken down Sizzle GX which is meant to be like a brilliant deck coming and then I've been testing them out with this I managed to um, take down Bellswolf and take it down Sizzle myself and it's, it's very powerful I, I want to see how it is with mirror matches I think against mirror matches it is great because of Glaceon it's probably the best partner that Solar can have for the new standard format at the post rotation. Um, I do want to apologize for the quality of the um, sound in this and the past couple of videos. I am trying to sort out a new mic, but it's just money at the end of the day. You know, I, unlike most people on YouTube, I do work for a living, so and I don't know that much. I'm not rich or anything. I'm quite poor, and I still got rent bills and that space. So it's, it's been a bit of a struggle. It's why you haven't really seen much videos from me lately. It's because of course I'm trying to. I have to. No matter how much I heard, I have to prioritize other things over YouTube. But I really do want to start this off. It's just getting the time and the money to do it. But, scratch that all away, let's get into the video. Um, I'm going to try something different, I'm going to do a both deck profile and a battle. So, deck profile, like I said, our two main protagonists is Glaceon GX and Solar GX. We all know what Solar GX does, so I'm not going to go bother going in detail, but essentially it's a trade. We're never going to use a GX tab. We might use Righteous Beating, which is trade damage for each Pokemon you have in play. So max 120, with a choice span 150. But our main attacker is Glacier GX. It has ability freezing, uh, freezing gates. As long as this Pokemon is reactive, all other GX and EX Pokemon in play has no ability. And this is great for turn 1. You want to start off going first with an EV in the active because then um, because we are playing the energy evolution EV which is if whatever type of energy you put on EV you can fold it into that type so put a smack of water energy on you get your glacier now simple as so you could put your opponent on a tapule non tapule start basically you can screw him over like this turn and with judge you could put them down to full card hand and they got no abilities it's like yeah I just screwed you over on turn 1 that's why it's so powerful especially in this new format um, but we are playing to from 3 of us one of us being Tappy Lele we're only playing 1 because your with trade you don't really need it that much you just want that Lele so you can get your judge on the first turn but if you can't judge Lily, and um, playing free free on the judge and the lilies, but we all know what they do. Um, but we're also playing the brand new Deoxys from Celestial Storm. It's for that psychic attack, does 20 damage plus 20 more for an amount of energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. It's mainly there for Buzz One, really. The Buzz One is going to max of three, so what? 360 80 as a choice band 110. You're getting a KO 
and you're getting a key on the rebuilds because that's suppose most likely will have three on it as well. So it's just there for that really, and it's retreat cost of one, so it's pretty nice. Uh, HP could be better, but still, it's pretty nice. And as well, we've got the promo that we can go for flying flip, of course. It's one of those decks where you do want to spread your damage. And it's very good if you can spread your damage. But that's it, really. Um, four EVs, three Glacier Young, two, two, so rock line. It's that simple. Let's get on to supporters. It's quite simple. Four Cynthia. It's going to be your main draw support. Four Guzmas, because you know, you do want to pull out your Pokemon you want to knock out. Three Judge and three Lilies. Lilies for the first turn, so it's Judge, but Judge is also good for destruction, and Lilies is great just for some draw power. Um, item cards, two Nest Balls, get, get your basics out quicker. And of course, four Ultra Balls, grab your Lilies. Um, but we're also playing only one Field Blower, because really, in the new format, format you don't really need Field Blower that much. Still have like one or two, but you don't need like three anymore in the new format. Um, three aqua patches just so you can get your water energies onto your glaciers quicker. And surprisingly, two energy lotters. Energy lotter is great for this deck, it helps search out for your waters and DCEs as you just see when not playing much energy. So it just it's there to help search out. And then finally, Rescue Stretcher, just just in case you discard Pokemon early on that you don't want to, you can just take it back out. Um, playing three choice bands just goes to do that edge of 30. And we're also playing the skateboard, since most of the Pokemon you want is it's, well, it's mainly for Deoxys and Lane But Basically, it's free retreat for those guys. So you've got free Pokemon with free retreat, and it helps retreating with Solarock and Glacier as well. Because then you have to give up one energy, not two. And you don't really want to give up your DCE since there's no other way to recover them. But yeah, we're playing four DCEs and seven more energies. I think that's the right amount for this deck. You don't want too much water. I mean, you're hardly ever going to use Aqua Patch, it's just there to be a little bit of a boost. That's why we're playing Energy Lotto, so it helps you get out of your deck quicker. But essentially, that is deck, so let's just jump right into some matches. Um, oh, there's my Ultra Mar. Glacier, there you are. Yeah, I've got you selected. I couldn't, I couldn't tell if I've got it selected or not. Um, I'm hoping we face someone who's joining out post rotation as well. If not, it might be a difficult match because in the format we are in right now, it's not that way. But it looks like we're facing off against Buzz. So hopefully, this will be a good match. He's going flip, so hopefully, we go first. Yes! Would you like to go first? Yes, I would. Um, oh. Okay, not, not the best of starts. Really, I want to do EV start and I've got neutral support. And he's playing Buzz as well. Okay, okay, we've got Nest Ball. Phew! Uh, let's have a look, let's see. We've got. Oh, okay, so we've got all else, all else. Uh, I'll do up as a prize there. You know what? This is the second match I faced Bowser with this deck. And both times now, Deoxys has been prized. Um, I might actually go up to two. Because that's what my mate Martin played. He played two, but I thought I'd rather have that extra. Gear has played three Guzma, I thought I had that fourth Guzma, but I might drop down to Bat Fins go where he does it. So let's get that out of the patch on. Yep. Let's get Glacier on. Sadly, we can't switch though. So he will get his Lele on his first turn. Sadly, but I can switch next turn. Uh, 
Okay. I mean, we've been starting off with my mates as he's a bit of a confident star. But he's got that first one, so he is playing patient. Ooh. Spicy. That's a bit spicy in the Buzzword deck. Because it's just only brought up Buzzword. So he's definitely playing Buzzword Black and Rock. And he's probably got the Guardian Mising with Black and Rock in there. Yeah, there we go. Three Sengi, he's getting the KO. Yeah, one training on Saw, that's a bit of an overkill. But I can hand hammer that off now. He's just scream. I got a good smack. Tied you for a not nine actually just getting rid of that one right just so he doesn't get up here and I get 30 damage on two bows wall which I'm not gonna come oh no I'm not actually I say that next time I just hope he doesn't get any did he play his draw support no he didn't so he's got no draw support either so he must be sitting there comfortably with not here But there's nothing else I could do. You can't attack now anyway. Oh, there's a strong energy. And a choice band, so he's doing an extra 50. They're doing 80. Ouch. Hmm, and that was my thing going on. Um, this one might be a crit match. But yeah, let's get that on. Doing 80. I might survive one more hit, but if I'm doing. I've got choice for no, no. Yeah, I could possibly GX him next turn. Let's just uh, hope he doesn't get another strong one. If he gets another strong one, he won this. If not, I won. Unless you get another basic down. Uh, another oh, I don't want to go. I want to draw support. Uh, but I should GX in for a win next turn if he doesn't knock this Glacian out. <laughs> yeah, come on, Grace. Pardo Sphere GX. Boom. <laughs> I want this about using any. Your support. <laughs> no, I think I got a bit lucky there. I had a trap, I should have lost that. But he didn't get any of his draw supports either, so it was like, yeah, okay. Oh. Getting that good as well, like so. Ah, uh, I'm um, give you another guy's another match that was a uh, bit of a Pathetic match, even though I did win. Um, um, once all this bit is done, yeah, he just started on the leaderboard today, so like, I could be at it. It's only nine times, which I got four off. So, like, not too fast. Thing is, nine times doesn't trade for much, and no one really wants it. So I can't really get any packs for it. But yeah, oh I won the point flex. Yes, I would like to go first then. Please give me a better start than last game. I didn't even see what you got. I actually love this start. So get Eevee down. We can't judge him sadly. But this is not a bad start. I am looking at all of this. We are looking at one space. It's a fire deck with Cosmo and. Hmm. Yes, we're drawing an extra. That was a choice band. Oh, we got a DC. Oh, I'm sorry, but that is too sexy. I've an open in hand. So we get sort down. Yeah, we got that place. Got one prized. 
doesn't matter. We got our glaze. We got our glaze on. I'm happy with that. He can't lay lay now. Um, I might not even play Cynthia. I might leave it because I've got the DCE in hand and I've got a full rock in hand. I don't want to give up them two. So I'm just gonna leave it like that. And then probably make him think, oh, he doesn't have draw support. I might not judge him or end him. Depending if this post will be teaching or not. Um, I didn't bother checking actually. But my, my best bet it, it is post rotation. It's not really a deck I've seen. I don't get why he's playing fire and you see them. I mean, what fire Pokemon can go? Yeah, <laughs> he doesn't. Um, Yeah, let's go to the rock. Let's put that on Deoxys. You know what I want to do though? Choice band. I'm not even going to use the rock trade ability. I don't want to give that Cynthia in my hand. I'm going to play that, grab a Guzma, and then knock out the Cosmog with the energy. Slow him down. That's the best thing. I mean, you see what? Because I bet you any money he has Lele in hand, but he just can't <laughs> play it because of Glaceon. So we'll put Glaceon up with Wasp up. And we'll put 38 on that Cosmog. And we get a prize. There's our other Glaceon we don't. We could trade that away. And hopefully get another Guzma. Guzma that card mark. If he doesn't get another basic down. I don't understand what this deck is. Oh he has oh he's must I had ultra ball so he couldn't lay lay. But he must have topped that that second more and you know, he just gave me to victory. See, this is what I want to show you with this deck. This deck, for some, he had Ultra Ball and Mysterious Treasure in hand. He can easily have gone for the Lele and grab his draw support, but he couldn't because Glaceon was in an active, it was stopping him, and he just couldn't set up. This is the power of Glaceon Zorwark. This is how good Glaceon is in the new format. I love it. Um, looking at the time, no, I'll, I'll make this video a little bit more actually longer. If you could put up with this poor quality, sound quality, but let's just get an awesome match. You will see more of this deck as well. I'm gonna play the hell out of this deck. So, shout out to my mate Martin. Freaking great idea what he did here with Glacier. For a coin flip, I get to go first on in a world. Oh, nice. I could go risky well, ultra ball for him later, get judge, and then hopefully hit a water energy. But I might just go straight for Cynthia. Or I give up every card in my hand, unless I talk that water, water energy. No. Um, let's see. That's the only thing that's annoyed me about this hand. It's just an uncovered water energy. Well, oh, we've really got Malele. <sighs> Judge. But I definitely want to get my Glacier on out. I'm scared of that like and what. Have a play. Oh, say hello. I bet it's like wondering if I'm here. Okay, no, I'm just thinking. Um, since it is a fight that I want to keep a hands hammer on me. So let's 
get rid of the scale and aqua patch. Who uh, can you see it's lay lays in here? Yeah, lay lays in there. So could lay actually lay lay would be the better option. So let's grab so what? Uh, I uh, always get rid of field blower and the skateboard. I don't think they're playing any stadiums that will or tools that will really hurt me. So I won't keep a hand summer. So let's grab Lele. Grab a Lily and get seven new cars and hopefully one of them for water energy. Got one Lily prize, but lots of things. So yeah, let's get seven cards. Yes, one of them was water, and we got a saw up the next turn. Let's grab that. Let's put our threat down as well. No dual support though, but we do have saw work, so I'm not too worried. Um, just do this. We stop him from Lele now, which I'm happy about. He's only got five cards in hand, so unless he's actually got a dual support in his hand, he might be screwed. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Don't want to have a choice when the skateboard on yet. Uh, Wade well, gave it to his skateboard. And, oh, he just He didn't have a draw support in hand. And he thought, oh, screw this. <laughs> I mean... I think that's like three matches. Like, first match, he couldn't... He, first match when I'm facing that boss wall. Uh, I should have lost. I can guarantee you that he probably had a Lele in hand. He could have got himself a draw support. Second match, he quit because he couldn't set up. Third match, he just went up straight quick. He didn't bother with his first turn. Good one. All because I had Glacier on out in my active. I mean, how. How good is it that it's putting pressure on your opponent first turn to make him want to quit? This deck is going to be great in the next four format. I am calling it now and I'm not the only one. Shout out to my mate Martin. Brilliant guy for coming up with this deck. It's a brilliant brilliant deck and I hope this video we does prove it I mean I have three very quick matches with it it's just it's just so good <laughs> I actually love it it's a brilliant deck it's great I just can't get over it how how people just quit that easily. We not had a deck like that in a while. Where it proper put pressure on your opponent first turn if they did not have a draw to put in their hand, it means they can't lay lay. But I mean, if you have enjoyed this video, just like and subscribe. I am going to bring you more of this deck and other interesting decks along the way for post rotation, of course. But until then, and hopefully I get a new mic by then. <laughs> but until then, have a nice night, and I shall see you in the next video. Goodbye, my friends.